So welcome to the inside of Memorial Hall Complex. Now there's some really cool things about this building that you can see right here. First thing you notice is all of that stained glass. This building actually contains the second largest amount of secular stained glass in North America. Now why? This place was actually founded in 1870 as a war memorial, commemorating the lives loss of Harvard undergraduates who fought for the Union during the Civil War. Now, this building is filled with history, but it's also filled with a lot of cool other things. Some of you may recognize this building. It's actually the place where CS50 lectures take place. So this is actually just outside of Sanders Theater where David Malin actually gives his lectures. This space is really cool because it's actually three functions. First, there's Sanders Theater, but also below us there's a bunch of classrooms and rehearsal rooms, and just over that wall is the freshman dining hall, which looks like Hogwarts. If you don't believe me, Google it. But in any case, back to Sanders. So by day, we all know it as where CS50 takes place. By night, this place is also an incredible auditorium for a large amount of concerts run not only by students but famous performers. For instance, Wynton Marsalis. Last year we actually had Matt Damon as the recipient of the Arts First Medal of Honor. And then this year we actually have Margaret Atwood. So there's a lot of awesome things about having a space that's not only driven for academics but also for your extracurricular activities.